Hey guys, it's Hannah, and today I'm coming to you with another double Owl Crate unboxing. I have here the November and December Owl Crate boxes, which I am very, very excited to open up because I have had them in my room for quite some time now. I am an Owl Crate rep, so every month Owl Crate sends me one of their lovely boxes to open here on my channel, and I also have a coupon code that you guys can use. You can enter the code Clockwork at checkout, and you will get that discount. I gain nothing from the code; it's totally just for you if you're interested in trying out Owl Crate for yourself. But without any further ado, because I've got two of them to get through and I really wanna know what books are in here. Let's get into opening the boxes. Starting off with the November box, let's see what's inside. The very first thing that's in here is the card as always, which tells you what the theme is and everything that's in the box. And the theme is castles, courts, and kingdoms for this month. All right, the first thing that I'm seeing in here, oh my God, this is so cool. Okay, the first thing that is in here is this beanie that says, Expecto Patronum, and it is so cute and so perfect. It also has the little owl here. I'm taking it out of the plastic, hold on. <laughs> Look at it. Look at this beanie, it's so cute. I have to wear it, hold up. Oh my God, oh my God, I love it. I love it so much. This is the best beanie I have ever seen in my entire life. Am I gonna keep it on for the rest of this video? Yes. <laughs> All right, the next thing that's in here is this little box that has the tree from like Lord of the Rings on it. And it says, speak friend and enter. So it's definitely from Lord of the Rings. I don't wanna rip the sticker though. I don't know how to open this. I had to tear the sticker. I didn't have a choice, but let's see what's inside. Okay, what is this? Oh my God, it's elven bread. It's elven bread soap. That is amazing. <laughs> okay, it looks like the little bread that they eat from the movies and it's like perfectly in the shape of that, but it's soap, which is amazing. <laughs> it's made by Fizzy Fairy Apothecary and the scent is a bright refreshing combination of Moroccan mint, garden cucumber, juicy clementine, lily and cactus. This is so, so amazing and I'm so excited to use it. The next thing that's in here is this little like pin, I believe, from Juniper and Ivy Designs. It's like this wooden pin. It says Squallers at the top. Is that from the Grisha trilogy? I think it's from the Grisha trilogy. <laughs> yep, there's a Lee Bardugo quote on the back. It's definitely from the Grisha trilogy. I took it out of the plastic so you guys can see the design up close, but it's really, really pretty and very nice. The next thing that is in here is this little chapstick that says winter is here. So it's a Game of Thrones chapstick, which is amazing. Also, I recently actually ended up watching the entirety of Game of Thrones a few months ago, not that recently, but I finally seen the entire thing. So now every time I get Game of Thrones merch, it makes me very happy and very excited. The next thing that's in here is the Owl Crate exclusive pin that's in every month's box and this one just has part of the artwork that is in their card. The next thing that's in here is this gorgeous, gorgeous notebook that has this beautiful artwork on it and it says, don't let the hard days win. I feel like this quote is from the Akatar series because I see it on so much Akatar stuff. So I think that's what this is referencing, but it's still very, very pretty. I haven't read that series, but I'm still gonna use this because it's gorgeous. And finally, the book that is in this month's box is The Glass Fair by Lauren Stefano, and this is an Alcrate exclusive cover, which they've been doing month after month now and that's so awesome. I've seen this book around but I actually have no idea what it's about so let's read the summary and find out. So reading the summary it's about this girl named Wilhelmina who is the daughter of this king of the wealthiest nation and she ends up finding out that she has the power to turn people into gemstone when she touches them and that kind of sounds like shatter me in the sense that whenever she touches someone she kills them which is what happens in here essentially too but that's just such a cool concept. I never thought about turning someone into gemstone, but it sounds really, really interesting and like a really fun fantasy. So I'm really excited to try this out. Of course, there's also a signed book plate included in here, as well as the note from the author that has this really pretty glass spare art on the back. And then there's some glass spare temporary tattoos, which is really fun. And lastly, of course, there is the newsletter that they include in every month's box that just has like more fun stuff that's in here that you can do and more info on the items in the box. But that is it for everything that was in the November Owl Crate box, which is amazing. Hands down, this is my favorite thing that was in there. I'm still gonna wear it to open the other one, unless there's another hat in there too, which then I'll switch hats, but I love this thing. <laughs> and now getting into the December box, let's open this one up and find out what's in here. All right, the first thing that's in here is the card as always, and the artwork on this one is so beautiful. I love this. It's so, so cute, so holiday -y and warm and cozy. And the theme for this month's box is seize the day. Okay, the first thing that I'm seeing in here is another Harry Potter themed item. I live for these Harry Potter items. And it is this gorgeous tote bag that says, don't let the muggles get you down. 
and it has all this cute artwork on it. Oh, and the back has a scar, a lightning scar. It's so great. I love it. I love tote bags and I love Harry Potter and this makes me so happy. <laughs> the next thing that I'm seeing in here is this candle that is called the Dreaming Tree from Novelly Yours. It's also an Alcrate exclusive, so let's open it up and smell it. Ooh, it's glittery. <laughs> I was not expecting the glitter in there, but it's really pretty and glittery. That smells really, really good. It smells like apple and like candy in a way, but like not overwhelmingly sweet. I really like the scent of this. The next thing that's in here is this gorgeous juniper and ivy design like wooden keychain type of thing. I'm not 100% sure what this is, but it says love is everything. That's the quote on it. And it's from Everything Everything by Nicola Yoon. It's so gorgeous. It's just the stack of books and it says I'll create 2017 at the bottom. The next thing that's in here is this double-sided bookmark. And one side has a quote from The Serpent King by Jeff Zenter. And it says, if you're going to live, you might as well do painful, brave, and beautiful things. And the other side has a quote from one of my favorite books, The Perks of Being a Wallflower. And it says, and in that moment, I swear we were infinite. It's beautiful and perfect. I love this. Okay, this next this thing is so, so amazing and I'm in love. It is this owl crate planner that has a little cute owl face on the front and it's basically a book planner. So you can catalog all of the books that you've read and then there are quotes on like the month pages from different YA books and this is just so so beautiful. I used to have like a planner type of thing like this where you'd have like a weekly planner and then a reading list and then there were like sections where you can document like your ratings for certain books and stuff which is just so cute, like a book log, like this. This is so perfect, I love it. I am 100% gonna use this to document all of my reading in 2018. So I will just have an entire just notebook dedicated to my books from 2018. And that's gonna be amazing. I'm so, so happy to have this. The next thing that's in here is this gorgeous magnet. And it has a quote from Rick Riordan that says, if my life is going to mean anything, I have to live it myself. And lastly, the book that is in this month's box is Foolish Hearts by Emma Mills. And this again has an Owl Crate exclusive cover. Okay, the cover of this is actually so so cool it looks like it's stitched in like fabric and it's so amazing and I know that Emma Mills books under the dust jacket yep Yep, that's gorgeous. <laughs> I actually don't know what this book is about at all. I own another one of Emma Mills books and I've seen this one going around, but let's read the synopsis to find out. So from what I gather, this is like a high school romance contemporary novel. It's about this girl named Claudia who witnesses the most popular couple in her high school go through a very public breakup. And then she ends up having to help one of the girls from that relationship through her breakup. And then she also ends up having a crush on this other boy who she's in a production of A Midsummer Night's Dream with. It just sounds very high school. It's sounds like a lot of the drama that you deal with while you're in high school. So it sounds like it's going to be like a really fun story. And I'm hoping that when I read it, it definitely takes me back to all of those high school drama feels. Along with the book, as always, there is a signed book plate, the note from the author. And this time we have this little Foolish Hearts little patch, which is really, really cute. And then lastly, there is the newsletter in here as well. And this one has the theme for next month, which is Fearsome Fairy Tales, which sounds really really, really amazing. And it's going to include a candle from Spireside Candles. So I'm very, very intrigued to see what next month is going to bring because both of these boxes were fantastic. But that is it for both of the unboxings. I hope you all enjoyed watching this video. Once again, a huge thank you to Alcrate for sending these boxes my way and for always doing such an amazing job with everything they include. All of Alcrate's information as well as all of my links for my social media are in the description box as always. But thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Bye.